Greetings to our Rochester City School District students, families, and staff. This is the last Friday before school starts and we are just three days away from the start of a new school year on Monday. We have the opportunity to start fresh. I shared with our staff earlier this week a message of our district's theme of Forward Together Now. Our staff heard this message during our first ever virtual Superintendents Conference Day, which provided an opportunity for four days of professional development so staff can be prepared for the start of school on Monday. We are also sharing with our parents a quick guide to help ensure a smooth return to school under our remote learning model. This document is located on the Reopens website under the Family Resources tab. Remember, no decisions have been made about how we will return to school after the first 10 weeks of remote learning. We will continue to reevaluate the all remote learning decision throughout that time. Last week, we sent a robocall to families with important information about immunizations. All those students are starting the school year under a fully remote learning model for the first 10 weeks. The New York State Department of Health is still requiring students to meet immunization requirements. If you are unsure if your child meets immunization requirements from New York State, please reach out to your child's doctor to find out if they are compliant. And if not, please make an appointment. It's hard to believe 19 years have passed since 9-11. Most of us remember exactly where we were when we heard the news that day. Some heard it on the radio driving to work, while others watched the news unfold on television. Many educators were in classrooms full of students trying their best to support them as they were grappling with the news themselves. I will never forget how our nation came together after the events of 9-11. Our community is currently experiencing sadness and pain over continued acts of violence against the black community. We are committed to caring for the social emotional health of our students, staff and community. And even though we are not physically in classrooms, I know you are here for our students and will support them in any way possible. We have added a special support section to our website that provides resources to help our students process and discuss what is happening in our city. While I will miss riding the bus to school with students on September 14th, we have so many new opportunities in front of us to begin the school year with success and promise. This year, we will move this district forward together now. I certainly hope you will join me in this effort.